What's up, everyone? I'm really excited about this, so I'm like, what the heck is happening? Oh, wait, no, no. Stop it. Okay, <laughs> sorry. This is gonna be a long intro, I'm sorry. Uh, I'm sorry I've been gone a while. I uh, had some internet trouble, won't get into that, but I am back and I got Mass Effect for Christmas, the whole entire trilogy. So uh, I'm going to be playing that for the next couple of months and uh, along with that I'm going to be playing the new games that come out this year. Uh, but um, anyway, um, the reason I'm playing this kind of late is because they never had the first game on PlayStation 3 and uh, I, am, I have not done this in a while so excuse me if I'm saying uh, a lot. Anyway, so yeah, they didn't have it on PlayStation 3 for a while, and but they had the second and the third game, and I really wanted to play the third game. Uh, it looked really, really interesting to me, and I watched a little bit, a teeny bit of the beginning of the gameplay, and I got really into it. Stop it. Stop it. <laughs> okay. Uh, and I got really into it, but I didn't want to, because I know this has, like, data you can transfer over to, like, the second and third game, and it affects what you do in the long term, and who shows up, who which character shows up, and what happens in the future, so I didn't want to just buy the third one and not play all the way through, because I know that a lot of people have emotional connection with these characters uh, at the end, and, uh, you know, I just, I wanted to feel that too, so this is, you know, I'm doing the same thing like I did with Uncharted, so, uh, I'm really excited, I love sci-fi, and, um, like, sci-fi is my favorite genre, I don't care what it is, if it's in books, if it's a movie, if it's a video game, I mean, I, I, I just love it so much, sci-fi is just absolutely, I love it so much, you know, <laughs> if people watch my, um, my movie, List, they know that Star Wars is at the top, and Welcome to a lot of actually sci fi movies database. are on my list, but classified Ooh. information requested. Um, okay, <laughs> establishing secure connection. Oh my god, I'm liking this already. <laughs> secure connection confirmed. It's like all sci fi. Um, profile reconstruct due to your covert N7 st data status. Status, really? Okay, ID records are incomplete. Please confirm identity from the records below or register manually. Confirm your ID, SCR John Shepherd, Alliance Marine. I shall. I want to. Please log in. in to access your confirm. profile. Um. Should I put. Should I put. Should I put my actual name or should I put John? I might as well just put John, whatever. <laughs> Uh, last name, Shepard. Profile reconstruction yep. complete. Ooh, I'm excited. Once you confirm your character is complete, you will be unable to change any settings. That is scary. All right, Identification confirm. confirmed. Combat difficulty casual. <laughs> I am, I'm sorry. Call me a wuss if you want, but I am not. I am not a, a, a I'm not an outstanding game player. Ah, uh, yes, please. Squad power usage, what's that? Squad will use all available talents, sure. Autosave? Yes, thank you! I, I hate it when they don't have autosave, and I'm afraid that's not gonna save. Like, Batman Arkham City, that was my problem. I know you just had to go through the door, and then it would- Oh my god, I'm so excited. <laughs> I'm so excited! I've wanted to play this game so long, you don't even know! So keep hearing about the ending. I I do not know anything about the ending, and if you spoil it, I am going to hate you forever, and you're going to be banned. Um, <laughs> uh, maybe I won't be like that, but I'm going to be really angry if you do. So just please, please, if you if you have any morals, <laughs> don't do that. I'm so excited. Oh my. God. Well, what about Shepard, Earthborn, but no record of his family. Doesn't have one. He was raised on the streets. Learned to look out for himself. He saw his whole unit die on a coups. He could have some serious emotional scars. Every soldier has scars. Shepard's a survivor. Is that the kind of person we want protecting the galaxy? That's the only kind of person who can protect the galaxy. I'll make the call. Ooh. 
The year is 2148. Explorers of Mars discovered the remains of an ancient spacefaring barring civilization in the decades that follow these mysterious artifacts revealed startling new technologies enabling travel to the furthest planets of stars the basis for this incredible technology was a force that controlled the very fabric of space and time they called it the greatest discovery in human history Sif ah! <laughs> darn it i was trying to read so fast i started out with like an english accent and i was like wait no i should probably like anyway One thing I'm concerned is that Your I read the back. Prime relays in range, initiating transmission sequence. Okay, I read the back of the game, and it's this is my first mature game, and I read the back, and it's had partial nudity. nudity that gets me a little. Calculating transit mass and destination. That gets me a little worried because I have no idea how I'm gonna like block relays that hot. out. Acquiring approach vector. So, uh, just All stations I hope, I hope that they're just not showing too much. Like, I don't mind it, but it's just for YouTube's sake. The board is green. Approach run has begun. This is so exciting, because this is made by BioWare and the same crew who made Star Zero Republic, and I hear you get some interesting decisions. One. So I love I love that about Star Wars: The Old Republic. So this is I'm just like ex extra excited about being able to make my own Thrusters, decisions. Apparently, check. if Navigation, not, then this is just awkward. Check internal emissions sync engaged. All systems online. Drift just under 1500k. Okay, why why is not good. syncing it? Your captain will be pleased. Okay, all right, that was synced up. I hate that guy. <laughs> Nihilus gave you a compliment. That wasn't really all that funny. So I'm just really excited. You remember to zip up your jumpsuit on the way out of the bathroom? That's good. I just jumped us halfway across the galaxy and hit a target the size of a pinhead. So that's incredible. Besides, specters are trouble. I don't like having them on board. Call me paranoid. You're paranoid. The council helped fund this project. They have a right to send someone to keep an eye on their investment. Yeah, that is the official story. Only an idiot believes the official story. Oh my god, this is so cool! What am I gonna choose? Uh, okay, why, why? Okay, here we go. Alright, I, I was trying to figure out. Uh, move less... Yeah, I just... <laughs> reply, okay, move the less stick to highlight a reply on the conversation. You will press the cross button to select. Wait, what do you mean cross button? What the heck is a cross... Oh, oh, cross... <laughs> Excuse me, I'm sorry. I, I, I am a little rusty. Um, I don't want to be like a complete, like, cut the chatter. Like, ugh. okay, this is going to be terrible. Okay, um, I'm sorry. I haven't done this in a while, and so I'm so excited. Uh, you're overreacting. You it's always it. expect the worst. Well, bad feelings are an occupational hazard. But we don't go anywhere unless there's a good reason, so what are we doing here? Joker, status report. Just cleared the mass relay, Captain. Stealth systems engaged. Everything looks solid. Good. Find a comm buoy and link us into the network. I want mission reports relayed back to Alliance Brass before we reach Eden Prime. Aye, aye, Captain. Better brace yourself, sir. I think Nihilus is headed your way. He's already here, Lieutenant. Tell Commander Shepard to meet me in the comm room for a debriefing. Ooh. You get that, Commander? <laughs> you made him mad. <laughs> I'm not gonna do that. I'll I'm on my way. <laughs> Is it me or does the captain always sound a little pissed off? Only when he's talking to you, Joker. <laughs> Probably. Press the start button to access the mission computer and view journal and codex entries. Let's do that now. Mission computer accesses your general map and other important screens. So bear with me. I am going into this completely blind. I don't know the controls yet. I'll get used to them. Uh, codex. God, this is so weird. Like, I'm used to just pressing the, um... I'm not used to using the joystick to move things. Okay, so... Codex, journal, map. So let's see the map. Okay, and then I have to get to... I have to get over here. Okay. So far, this is kind of confusing. Oh, right. oh wait, oh wait, I got it. Oh, this is a lot like the Old Republic, in a way. Uh, so this, I mean... 
I- I'm gonna be saying the Old Republic a lot because it's the same company who made it, so bear with me again. <laughs> uh, sc- the squad screen lets you view talents for each squad member. Press the up button or down button to, re- to view general descriptions of a talent. Sorry, I'm just, I don't want to read, like, the whole thing. Oh, I have three points? Cool. Oh, so then I can just, like, increases accuracy, auto level up, um, purchase rank. Oh! Combat armor. Um, let's do this one. Um, and let's do this one. I have one more point. So, assault rifle. What, what, what? Uh, which one should I get? Someone's, someone's gonna like yell at me. No, you should get that! Uh, come back. Uh, yeah, I should probably. Can I get this? No, I can't. Alright, um. I'll figure this stuff out. <laughs> Sorry, I just wanna. Prologue of the Normandy. You. Normandy. You are Lieutenant Commander Shepard, Executive Officer of the SSV Normandy. That sounds like the USS Enterprise. Uh, speak to the captain. Oh! Oh, so that shows your mi- oh, okay, that makes sense. Oh, so that's what happens when you can't go anymore. Okay, that makes sense. Alright. Assignments? How do you get to that? No assignments yet. Okay. Sorry, I'm just trying to figure all this out. Codex. Personal history. Sure. You're born on Earth, but you never knew the. Pa- okay. But you never knew your parents. A child on the streets, you learned to live by your wits and got surviving the hidden underbelly of the metro- me- megatropolises of. What? <laughs> okay, anyway, of <laughs> humanity's homeworld. Eager to find a better life, you joined the Alliance military where you, became, you, where you came of age. You volunteered for an expedition to Al. Akuzi, a lush world on the outskirts of Alliance space that had suddenly dropped out of contact, arriving on the surface. Your control, your patrol, found the settlement intact, but no survivors. At nightfall, the Thresher Maws struck mindless abominations of teeth and tentacles that rose up from beneath the. Oh crap! You kidding me? <laughs> I'm not good at monsters, especially in video games. Um, constant gunfire couldn't drown out the shrieks of your fellow soldiers as they were dragged down to a gruesome death. Oh my god, that's terrible! Fifty Marines died on Akuzi. Cause I'll c- I- I'm sorry if I'm saying that wrong. If if someone knows how to say it, then please like put the pronunciation in the comments. You were. The only one to make it back to the landing zone alive. That is terrible. A monument on the planet commemorates the massacre. A grim reminder of the price humanity must pay as they spread throughout the stars. That is so... Me- that is so sad. Humanity System Alliance. Alliance is the government and military of the humanity beyond soul. I'm not gonna read all this. Come on. <laughs> You're like, are you kidding me? No. Squad. Oh, I was just here. All right. All right. Resume now. Sorry. I just wanna. I'm telling you, I just saw him. He marched by like he was on a mission. He's a specter. They're always on a mission. Okay. So do. Right along with him. Relax, Presley. You're gonna give yourself an ulcer. Okay. So basically, I think. These have a lot of side missions. Did he just? That's crazy. The captain's in charge here. He wouldn't take orders. For okay. Us. Obviously, I don't think it can go that way. Uh. Hello. Um. The heck you're supposed to do? All right. Now I'm confused. Um. Oh, is this the guy? No, because it's not, it's not. Ah, there we go. There we go. Sorry, I'm learning. Okay, so this is the guy. Commander Shepard, I was hoping you'd get here first. It will give us a chance to talk. What? The captain said he'd meet me here. He's on his way. I'm interested in this world we're going to, Eden Prime. 
I've heard it's quite beautiful. I've never been there. But you know of it. It's become something of a symbol for your people, hasn't it? Proof that humanity can not only establish colonies across the galaxy, but also protect them. But how safe is it, really? If you've got something to say, just say it. Your people are still newcomers, Shepard. The galaxy can be a very dangerous place. Is the Alliance truly ready for this? I think it's about time we told the Commander what's really going on. This mission is far more than a simple shakedown run. Is someone gonna fill me in, Captain? We're making a covert pickup on Eden Prime. That's why we needed the stealth systems operational. There must be a reason you didn't tell me about this, sir. This comes down from the top, Commander. Information strictly on a need-to-know basis. A research team on Eden Prime unearthed some kind of beacon during an excavation. It was Prothean. I thought the Protheans vanished 50,000 years ago. Their legacy still remains. The mass relays, the Citadel, our ship drives. It's all based on Prothean technology. This is big, Shepard. The last time humanity made a discovery like this, it jumped our technology forward 200 years. But Eden Prime doesn't have the facilities to handle something like this. We need to bring the beacon back to the Citadel for proper study. Obviously, this goes beyond mere human interests, Commander. This discovery could affect every species in Council space. Are we expecting trouble? I'm always expecting trouble. There's more, Shepard. Nihilus isn't just here for the beacon. He's also here to evaluate you. <laughs> like, oh, yes, sir. Uh, I'm gonna be called, like, I should. Guess that explains why I bump into him every time I turn around. The Alliance has been pushing for this for a long time. Humanity wants a larger role in shaping interstellar policy. We want more say with the Citadel Council. The Spectres represent the Council's power and authority. If they accept a human into their ranks, it shows how far the Alliance has come. Not many could have survived what you went through on Akuz. You showed a remarkable will to live. Oh, Akuz. A particularly useful talent. That's why I put your name forward as a candidate for the Spectres. I assume this is good for the Alliance. Earth needs this, Shepard. We're counting on you. I need to see your skills for myself, Commander. Eden Prime will be the first of several missions together. You'll be in charge of the ground team. Secure the beacon and get it onto the ship ASAP. Nihilus will accompany you to observe the mission. Just give the word, Captain. We should be getting close to Eden. Captain, we got a problem. What's wrong, Joker? Transmission from Eden Prime, sir. You better see this. Bring it up on screen. Uh oh. Uh oh. Get down! I'm gonna beat him now. <laughs> we are under attack, taking heavy casualties. I repeat, heavy casualties. We can't get evac. They came out of nowhere. We need. This scares me. <laughs> Whoa! What is that? <laughs> that no calm traffic at all just goes dead there's nothing reverse and hold at 38.5 i'm scared now status report 17 minutes out captain no other alliance ships in the area take us in joker fast and quiet this mission just got a lot more complicated a small strike team can move quickly without drawing attention it's our best chance to secure the beacon Grab your gear and meet us in the cargo hold. Tell Alenko and Jenkins to suit up, Commander. You're going in. Dun dun dun! I just ruined that really dramatic scene. I'm sorry. Engaging stealth systems. I'm scared now. Like, Somebody was doing some serious monsters digging. Monsters are gonna like here, set Captain. me off. It's like it's like an Uncharted, like the first. Your Uncharted. team's the muscle in this operation, Commander. Go in heavy and head straight for the dig site. What about survivors, Captain? Helping survivors is a secondary objective. 
The beacon's your top priority. Well, excuse Approaching me. Approaching drop point one. I'd rather save people. Nihilus, you coming with us? I move faster on my own. Oh, one of those type of people. Nihilus will scout out ahead. He'll feed you status reports throughout the mission. Otherwise, I want radio silence. Ready and able, sir. The mission's yours now, Shepard. Good luck. Thanks, because I'm going to need it. <laughs> we are approaching drop point two. All right, saving data. All right. Ship perimeter secure, Commander. I'm scared now. Uh, next time I shall play this. Um, maybe they saved. Hard, Commander. Hostiles everywhere. Keep your guard up. Press square button to draw on your weapon. Press the circle button to holster your weapon. Oh, come on. Um, all right. Well, yeah, next time I am going to do this. I'm scared. Uh, I might just, like, do two episodes today since it's, like, you know, a new game. Uh, anyway, thanks so much for watching. Please subscribe and remember to always keep it real. Hey, bye.